I say this to the Jewish people. We are going through the most important holidays of our life this week. It is Rosh Hashanah, which in Hebrew means the head of the year. That is our that is our Jewish New Year. That is our when we give our when we talk about resolution. What is going to be our next resolution? So we go to Rosh Hashanah. We have what we call the ten days of awe, and then we go to something called Yom Kippur, which is your Day of Atonement. You pray for your sins. You repent for all the sins that you have done. If Jewish people, liberal Jews, are going to synagogue and repenting for their sins, and then they go the next day and support left-wing Antifa, aren't they committing the sin again? So again, if you love Israel, if you support Israel, if you give money to Israel, you will stand by President Trump or or denounce your religion or don't be Jewish. Seriously, don't be Jewish. Do not go against your own. I can't stand Jewish people that go against their own. It kills me inside. And these left-wing groups are trying to take away our freedom of rights away, just like the Nazi regime did. That's how they took, that's right, that's how they took power. And they took the rights away from my family and other families out there. We were, I'm gonna educate young people now. We were legal citizens of Europe. We were legal, legal. We were stripped of our of our rights by a man named Adolf Hitler and his minions. We were names and then we became numbers. Our hair was cut off, we wore striped pajamas. 1,500 people died in the trains every single day and you go to the trains and you don't know where the hell you are going. You get off that train, you have your mother holding your hand to your right, you have your father holding your hand to the left and you don't know if you're gonna see your parents ever again. So when Ocasio-Cortez says that detention centers are like concentration camps, it is day and night, it is not true, and it is a slap in the face to Holocaust survivors. Slap in the face. And I know as a Republican that the Republican Party supports Israel, supports Jewish Americans. So if you see a Jewish person, if you see a gay, if you see someone who's Democrat, don't write them off. You educate them. 